Hi everyone, welcome to InfoCloud. We live in an age of constant electronic communication. But today, we are talking about an older form of communication, the radio. In times past, especially during a war, armies would use radios to communicate with each other. And there would be times when countries would use a strategy of radio silence. This meant stopping all radio communication for a time. But even though we don't use radios as much anymore, we still do use this term radio silence to talk about someone not speaking or posting publicly for a while. For example, the movie star's agent advised him to go radio silent for a few weeks after the scandal. If the star was involved in something bad, like a scandal, they probably want to avoid attention. But they may break the silence with an apology. When you break the silence, you make a noise when others are silent. Now this can have a very literal meaning. For example, clearing your throat <clears throat> to start a conversation. But break the silence is often used to describe someone giving a comment or explanation after a period of not discussing something publicly. For example, the star is finally breaking his silence about breaking up with his girlfriend. That means he is planning to share more details with the public about what happened. Whether you are breaking your silence about a secret or breaking the silence to start a conversation, be brave and speak up. 我们经常注意一些名人或明星的一言一行。如果突然没有他们的消息，他们的社群账号也没有动静，你可以说他们是radio silent，也就是在公众场合中保持沉默。radio是无线电，silent是安静。在战争时期，军队是用无线电保持通讯，有时候为了战略考量会突然中断通讯。因此, radio silent 就有公开断讯的含义 The movie star goes radio silent after the scandal 在丑闻爆发之后, 那位电影明星突然消失, 保持沉默 如果要打破沉默, 那就可以说, break the silence The movie star is finally breaking his silence 那位明星终于打破了沉默 这就是今天的InfoCloud, 我们下次云端见